Hey everybody, Tremaine here. Um, October is right around the corner and I need to get my breast cancer awareness drone all prepared. Because you know, October is breast cancer awareness month and I built this drone specifically for that. But there's a lot different with this drone for this year. Um, I changed the frame, the motors, the propellers, the camera, just a total different setup than last year. I'll um, post some of my last year videos of Breast Cancer Awareness Drone in the link and in the corner. So let me run y'all through what I got so far, starting from the motors. These are Zine uh, 2306 2450 kV, and the propellers are four inch propellers. These are the Gen, uh, the Gem Fan. Uh, wind dancers 4023. I know some of the professionals out there probably wondering why I got such a low pitch uh, four inch prop in a low KV motor. Uh, this this is I'm going for efficiency. So um, with the low KV and low pitch four inch props, I should be able to fly for a very long time with this particular drone. And I'm not looking for so much power, but I hope it's not too weak to where, you know, I have to really jam the throttle to get it to move. But at that point, that'd be all experience based. But if it's not flying the way it should, I'll go back to um, a five inch or better yet, get a four inch, a uh, bigger four inch propeller, like a 40, 53 or some shit. Moving to the frame, I have the iFlight uh, something five, I can't remember, but this is one of the uh, newest iFlight frames. This is this was built for the HD version, but I got the analog system in here because I don't want to put analog in all my drones. Y'all know I got about 21 drones and um, to put digital and all of them it'll cost a pretty penny so i'm going to keep this one um analog and see what happens the only hd drones i want to have is my gps drone and my cinewalk so i have three hd drones so far including this little guy we'll talk about him later all right so that's the frame and i have a predator 5 um analog camera and that's pretty much it the guts i changed from the old frame to the new and um yeah probably sometime this week i'm gonna do a flight video and uh let y'all check it out but yeah breast cancer awareness drone aka pinky is new and improved hopefully these propellers work out if not we'll just simply change it all right Moving on, this here is an all new four inch long range HD drone. With, I bought the 1100 GMB HV 4S batteries. I'm, I'm supposed to get 25 plus minute with those, but we'll see. These two drones, I have separate videos. I don't want to put two different drones in the same video because I know most people got like a five minute attention span. So I'm going to make it easy for y'all. Uh, anyway, this is a four inch drone. Um, the name of this bad boy is The Explorer. I asked some people to help me name it. They didn't name it. But if somebody want to name it, go for it. But for right now, it's called The Explorer because that's why I built it. I built this drone to go on um, road trips with me and vacation. And I wanted it to be a GPS drone because I feel more secure about flying in an area I'm not familiar with. Because I know it's gonna come back to me via GPS. So that's why I built this. So now I have 21 drones, including this bad boy. All right, um, oh yeah. So this is a diatone frame called the LR four inch and I have the um, Cadets Polar HD system in here real clear real beautiful camera um, 
yeah so what wait what flight can so the flight controller i got in there is a beta flight f4 flight controller i know a lot of y'all don't know what the hell that mean but yes yeah, the beta 4 i mean the beta flight f4 flight controller and it's a uh i think it's a 30 amp esc four and one but anyway yeah this this thing was built for long range efficiency and the hd camera i'm gonna use for it is going to be the um the insta 360 go to that's that's what this is designed for the camera for this bad boy is the one i'm actually holding in my hand it is the um gopro hero 8. they have the 9 and the 10 out now but my 8 works great for the resolution that i use so yeah these will be up in the air soon y'all stay tuned oh wait so i like to um if i'm gonna do videos where i'm just basically talking i want to give a shout out to my favorite brewery well one of my favorite breweries toppling goliath based out of decor iowa this is a 5.8 uh alcohol level pale l this is a very good beer if you just want to sit back relax and have a beer something that won't get you fucked up like a ipa will um just something different you know it tastes good it's real good way better than those truly's and shit like that i don't drink those yeah, if i want a light beer i want it to taste like this any hook that's my opinion but yeah y'all stay tuned train the train over and out